Welcome back to the Infected TVF Gaming. Jumping back into one of our favorite survival games. It is now day five. Wow, day five already. Which means, if I remember correctly, today is the day that we potentially have to start dealing with Bambies. I don't know if that's accurate, but I don't know if that means they're the wandering ones or if we start getting the nighttime horde. I'm not 100% sure, but we've got to be very careful. We're getting started today on the build because if we're going to be having to defend against Bambies, we need to get out on the water and get ourselves a little bit of defense right here so they can't get straight to us, hopefully. We'll be a little bit safe, hopefully. <laughs> I don't know. But let's go ahead and start getting our little ghost outline going at least. Well, it's a little bit rainy here. I did a little bit of gathering yesterday to make sure I got a little bit of logs and stuff ready to go to get us started. There you go. I think I can go out a little ways like this. Come on. There you go. There you go. There you go. All right. So that's about how far out we're going to build, I believe. So we need quite a bit. So that's... What is that? One, two can't see it one two three four five six five or six so that's six we'll say six times four 24 24 logs all right and then i've got a whole bunch of planks already as well do i have an empty thing to move them with i don't uh we could maybe use this let's do this there we go use this to move a bunch of the planks over there kind of quickly all right let's go like this start getting as many planks as oh wow <laughs> We have space issues. All right. So let's go see if we can put these down somewhere. Let's go. Do I have any room anywhere? No. Any room in there? I can take that out. Put that in. There we go. That helps a little. All right. That is it for right now. And the sticks can go in here. All right. That's a little better. That gives us a little bit of room at least. All right. Hopefully I can at least get a few more blanks. All right. Let's go with like crazy. Oh, crap. We are super thirsty. What am I doing with my life? Hold on. Sorry, we're so excited about getting started on building that we didn't even get ourselves squared away for food and water. It's a survival game. Pay attention. There you go. All right. Uh, we need to go ahead while we're going at it. Let's go ahead and get some more water going. So quick detour. And then we'll get back on the plank action. And we're going to get a way better setup for this so we can have more water going at once. There we go. Oh god, it's already happening. Uh, it's happening. Get away. Get away from my face. Get away. Alright. We are going to use the cheaty method. I'm going to literally leave him here. Did I break my spear? I did. I'm glad it worked. We're going to leave him here. That should stop others from spawning if it's still like the last update. If not, we'll know soon. We'll get another one. There you go. Day 5. We got our first Bambi. They found our house. <laughs> there we go. Okay, let's move that up. Let's see if I can find a spot for this bone. Maybe here. Can I shuffle things around at all? There's like no way to put anything here. Any bones? There we go. All right. And that can go in there. There we go. Now we got space. Now we have all the space in the world. Now we can grab planks for days. Put a few stacks in there. Not very many, actually. All right. We'll see how many we can carry. Okay. Looks like that's it. While we're here, let's do this. We'll refill that one. All right, let's go. Let's start getting these built out just a little bit. Here we go. All right, one, two, three. And we can finish out the planks. There's one. Nice. We'll at least get out on the water and feel a little bit safer. We did all this gathering last night. This helps a little bit. Helps to get us out here. Feels like we're making real progress. There you go. Oh, next one. And then, actually, that last one we might not do. Hold on. Oh, my God. My bad. Stamina problems. I need to get our food filled up just a little bit. All right. Let's go. Boom. All right. And then this one I actually think we're not doing. Okay. Get rid of that one. How do I get rid of it? No. Oh, delete. There we go. All right. So let's put this back for just a second. Now, instead of doing... There you go. So instead of doing further out from right here, we do a little circle action. So let's go foundation triangles. Hmm. I don't know how this is going to look. We should go one more. 
we're gonna need enough space. Because even though we're gonna build up, we're gonna be on the ground floor to begin with. So maybe we should go like this, go like that. So these two will be regular. That one will be regular. And then these will be circular again. And boom. By the way, I love the ghost building system in this game. It is one of my absolute favorite ways to build. This is what I wish Conan still was. They changed up the Conan stuff. If you guys play Conan, they changed it in a way that definitely is not what I like. It doesn't mean it's bad. It's just not for me. All right, let's go like that. We're going to have to get way more logs again. We should be able to finish this out. Okay. And this is nice because I can get out to all of it. All right, let's grab all of the planks. And we'll finish out as many planks as possible. Oh, man, I love being able to finish a lot like that. It makes me so happy. All right, cool. That gives us a little bit of progress. All right, there you go. The start of the base build. It's not impressive yet, but it will be, I promise. So our plan, and I've explained it a couple times, but now as we got a little bit of visualization, hopefully we can kind of tell now. So basically you have from here to here is going to be the entrance to the base, uh, and eventually this will be gone. There won't be an actual little bridge right here. It'll be an elevated platform, so that way they can't get right in. I don't know if that makes sense, but the, the base is going to be about this tall, and it's going to extend out to those little land pieces over there. And I don't know. It, it should be very defendable. It should be easy to do. I'm hoping that it's going to work. All right, let's get some food going. We cooked a little bit of food last night. Let's go ahead and eat you. And I, I did go ahead and butcher one of the raccoons. I was hoping that it was going to give us... Oh, can I not eat the cooked liver? There you go. There we go. Yeah, I was hoping that the, the raccoon was going to give us hide. I didn't realize that it didn't. Okay, there's that. Let's eat just a little bit of fruit. There we go. There you go. That's pretty good. All right, and then let's get our... Oh, we didn't finish the water. My bad. We got distracted. That's kind of how it always happens for us. And like that. Let's do one more to make sure it's all the way full. There you go. And... There you go. And then we're going to empty this guy. Awesome. Awesome. Okay, we're good to go there. Let's go ahead and make sure we still got this going. Get all these off here. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Eventually, we'll get our storage resorted out. I know right now it's an absolute nightmare and a mess. We will get that fixed soon. Let's eat, let's eat that. Let's store that. Okay, we are good to go on food. We're okay on water. Let's get some of this going. Just to get it going, throw a couple sticks on here. There you go. Stick action. Light it up. Up. Okay. We'll get a little bit more clean water going. Make sure I emptied out the other part. Good. All right. Cool. Also, what do I need to make a canteen? That's something we really need. That'll help out big time. Others. I actually don't know what it looks like. Food resources. A large flask is three aluminum ingot. I did find a little bit of aluminum, but probably not enough when we were in town. Probably just a couple. Actually, I don't know what it looks like. It should be like a weird nugget looking one, right? I don't know. Once we get ourselves a little bit of organization, we'll be able to find it. Right now, I have no idea. All right. I know we have some somewhere. Just a matter of finding it. Okay. All right. We're still waiting on the bricks. Nope. We're doing pretty good there. We've got enough bricks now to get most of that done. So let's go like that. Like that. Like that. Like that. That gives us 40 of the 50 dry bricks. Nice. Awesome. That's a big step. We still need more clay, I think, to get the next part done. All right. Let's go log hunting again. This is going to be a lot of log hunting today. So let's go here. We do need to get this one going. Get as much out as we can. Nice. Okay. One more on here. All right. Let's go throw these planks down so we won't be so heavy. And then we'll grab a whole bunch more tree stuff. I thought I saw a bear. Maybe not. Maybe not. All right. Okay. Six there. Six there. Six there. And we just need... We only need four more to finish out the little first part of the base. That's awesome. That is awesome. Okay, cool. All right. Log action. 
So now it's just going to be a lot of this. So unfortunately, normally what I'm going to do in the future is we're going to fast forward through a lot of this because we're a little bit crunched for time today. Which I know you guys hear me say that all the time. We got off work a little bit late today, so I'm recording this right before the video has to go out. So I'm trying to get this done a little quick. So we're not going to do much editing on this one. But normally I will fast forward through some of this little like monotonous gathering stuff. Especially as we get further into the playthrough. I'll try to skip through some of the more boring stuff. I don't know, that's just kind of something that we like to do for the videos, but I'm going to try to also improve my editing overall. We've been trying to add a little bit of, like, the little cinematic thing in the beginning. I'm going to try to start doing some more stuff like that. It's not something I'm very familiar with. I'm all self-taught on Adobe Premiere, and I'm definitely a rookie on it, so we're still kind of learning how to use it. And we're trying to get a lot better at it, but it's, it, it takes a lot. It's pretty intensive learning. I'm really enjoying it. I'm actually going to see. Okay. I'm going to see if there's actually a in-person class here in the, uh, the town that I live in to see if it's something we can go sit down. I would love to sit down and actually take one. Or maybe even like a virtual class where I can just get more like instruction for it. All right, just a few more. Almost got it. And this is going good, man. Yeah, but we don't, we don't talk about it much, but I, I actually have a bunch of IT certifications. That's kind of what we, fun we specialize in. But stuff like this, editing and stuff like that, no experience whatsoever in something we just kind of self-taught through you know random youtube videos and just kind of learning it like that and it's been fun it's been fun but i really want to start stepping up our game in that, in that matter now i'm hoping here in a few months we're going to have a bunch of free time we're going to be moving to a new job position that's going to be way less intensive it's going to be awesome all right there we go there might even be some work at home stuff which would be kind of amazing all right there we go All right, this might finish out all of that. We're just going to go right out here on the thing. One, two, three, one. Oh, man. Okay. Got it. Oh, man, we are short one log and just a couple planks. All right, we grab the planks. Let's grab the logs. We're doing a lot of sprinting. I need to keep an eye on all my stuff. We're out in the sun a lot. Let me keep an eye on my sunburn. Or sun exposure, whatever that button's called. We should probably do like one or two collections of planks too. Just to keep us good on that. Because we still got to build walls. I don't think we can build the gate yet, but I'll take a look at it. All right, let's do a little bit of planks first. Oh, God. Scared the crap out of me. Stop that, raccoon. See, we need... Oh, hold on, we have a backup spear over here. Boom. We can also make a quiver now. We should probably do that soon as well. All right, let me see. Get these ones going. And then let's see what we need to do to make a gate. Copper ingots. So I can't quite make that. Okay. How about a barbed wire fence? Iron fragments and iron ingots. We could do that. Hmm. But we really need that gate. Okay. Wooden fence. And log spikes. Those are kind of the things that we need to get going. All right. Now, the log spikes, from what I understand, will not stop the boss. And the boss will wreck through our base. So I'm very, very worried about that. Okay. There you go. Uh, in fact, let's keep those two. Let's grab a whole bunch of these. Right. Move some more over. Okay. Looking good. All right, let's go put this down. So there you go, man. There's our, our first foundation laid out. One, two. We just needed the one. Okay. Yeah, there we go. Oh, man, the start of the base build. I kind of need a screenshot of this. There you go, starting our water base build. There you go. Boom, screenshot. All right, cool. Now, how do we want to do this? Because I, I, this is really just a foundational piece. We're going to be building up from here, but I should probably still do walls. In fact, the staircase up is probably going to be inside of here. Hmm. We could make it a little bigger. Man, see, I should have done this in creative first. Hmm. If we had time, I would have jumped over to creative and done that for a little bit, but that's fine. One, two, three, four. All right, let's take a look at it. So if we start doing walls, we could, we could definitely outline this with walls. Or should we just worry right now about door, railing? We could worry about this front side and just get ourselves a little bit of defense first. 
So copper ingot. We obviously can't do yet. But man, if we could get this right here, that'd be incredible. Okay. Let's move you. Move you out here. Okay. So now I want to do another foundation. Oh, it's not snapping like I thought it would. Hold on. And let's move you guys. Move you. And move you. Uh, what do we need? Water? Oh, sun. Hold on. Let's get out of the sun for a minute. We need to get ourselves a hat and some other stuff made up. That'd be a really good idea soon, too. Uh, maybe we can do that early on. I think it wasn't too hard to make. Let's take a quick look at that. Other armor and clothes. There we go. A hat. Oh, my God. It's just plant fiber. What am I doing? Plant fiber times eight. Okay. All right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We got a cap. Boom. Okay, we have a cap on. That'll help out with the sun just a little bit. Itempedia, armor clothes. What else can we do? Cloth Kevlar, no. Cloth Kevlar, no. Kevlar, no. That's just fiber and feather. Cloth times six. Cargo pants. And that one is, that one, four cloth is... Why are you scaring me, little dude? Stop. <laughs> the dude scared me. All right. What is that? Wait, that said four cloth or... I think that said four cloth. Because cloth I can't do. My bad. Cloth, cloth. Plant fiber feather. Plant fiber feather. Okay, so if we could get cloth, we could start making those ones. We're kind of stuck until then. But if nothing else, we have a hat. We're kind of a big deal. All right. Dude, you got to stop. Ready? We sprint on three. One. I think we can sneak him. Okay, come to me. No, no, I wasn't ready. Got you. <laughs> Out here trolling my base, man. All right. Uh, should we go ahead and carve the bear up to get that so we can get our arrows going? Let's do that now. So we're going to do this. You stay there. You come here. That scared me a little. We're going to take this guy inside and go ahead and carve him up because we really need to be able to shoot arrows just in case we get attacked. Okay. We're going to go like that. Drop you just randomly in the base. And we're going to... Oh, can I not remove him? <gasps> I can't remove him. Okay, looks like we're carving him. Dang it. That's fine. Gives us a little bit of stuff. And then you. On there. And carve him up. It's going to give us a bunch of stuff. Boom. All right, we're actually heavy on meat, and we have our hide. Boom, boom, boom. Let's go place all that in there if we can. Grab the other hide. And then is it, it's too high to make a quiver? Is that right? No. How do I make a quiver? Hold on. Itempedia. The quiver is too high to rope. Okay, to rope. Okay, one, two. All right. Two rope, two hide. Boom, we have a quiver, finally. Kind of a big deal. Give me my whole six arrows. Let's go get our bow off the ground that we left out here. Uh, we got to make room. Hold on. Uh, weapon. There we go. All right. Uh, the torch or the spear. I don't want to get rid of the spear because we can still use it for frogs and stuff. I don't want to get rid of the torch, but we have to for right now. There you go. We have a bow. All right. Now, somewhere there should be... A place for arrows, right? Or did I not equip the quiver? We made the quiver. How do I know if it's on? Hold on, we gotta go clean our hands. Clean the hands. There we go. Let's get our water filled back up. I don't know how. Uh, still don't know how about the ar the arrow here. All right, hold on. Get that. Drink it up. Alright, now how about a food prep table? That's kind of important right now, too. There's so many things we need. Food prep table. Where is it? Food prep table is nails. Okay. Alright, we are officially about out of space here. <laughs> so much not room. Okay. 
We need two logs, ten planks, ten nails. All right, there's eight, nine, ten. Okay, nails we got. Go like that, nope, like that, nope. Uh, somewhere. Okay, get some of that. One, two, three, four, five, six. Is that it? Seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, throw these on there. Okay, get a bunch of these. Can I not? There you go. Just gonna put those on there just to get this going again. We'll worry about some more stuff here soon. All right, and then. Okay, that's going. And then let me grab the actual iron out here. I think I have iron. One iron. Make our stack of nails. All right, all I need now is two logs. Let's grab two logs real quick. Somewhere out here we had a bunch chopped down, but that's fine. There we go. All right, two on here. And boom, and then what else we need? The nails. Boom, all right, we got a food prep table. Now, what I wanted to do that for was we had the liver. I might have the stuff. Maybe not, but I might have the stuff to make something good. Let's see. Food. It's usually the stew mix, right, is what we usually go with. Fruit salad, bacon pie, potato pie, bacon pie mix, potato pie stew mix is one meat, one liver, one potato, one onion. All right. And we picked up so much stuff here. Oh, hold on. Let's pick you up. All right, there is a onion sprout. That's not what we need, maybe. Potato sprout, that's like the seeds. It's not gonna help us. Somewhere there's a potato. Okay, no. Okay, potato. And then one meat, one liver we already have. But I don't know if that's the right thing. I don't think that onion sprout is the right one, dang it. So if we don't have an onion, dang it, dang it. I thought maybe we'd have it. We don't. Okay, we're going to have to wait. Okay. Hmm. I could have swore we just had like one onion that we had found. But we can get it planted. I don't know if it'll be ready before this stuff is, is done. Okay, for right now, let's put that stuff back. Okay. All that stuff in there. Let's grab that one coal, put it in here. We'll keep that one going. Right, got more iron. All right, one, two, three, one, two. All right, then we can throw that stuff back in there. All right, a lot of that is gonna go bad. We should probably make some more drying racks so it doesn't go bad. Let's just do that. We'll go drying rack for now. I would love to cook most of this up, but we're kind of stuck until we get some more storage space and actually get some actual things going. We're making a lot of progress. The problem is knowing what we're doing now. We kind of halfway know what we're doing. Oh, are you coming for me? <laughs> I thought he was coming for us. Okay, we got tons of meat. Yeah, but uh, we kind of know what we're doing somewhat, which actually makes it harder because I want to do so much at once. All right, let's do this. Take these back. Okay, one, two. Take you inside. Harvest. 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 There you go. Okay, add all those. Plus two ropes. One, two. There you go. Boom, okay. That way we can at least dry a little bit more meat. Two, three, four, and five. And I guess we can dry, grab the dried meat off of here. And just store it somewhere. One, two, three, four, five. All right. And then these final couple will go like that. 
I really don't want to cook these livers, man. We want to save them, but they don't last that long. So for right now, we're going to have to say goodbye to them. Eventually, we'll use them for cooking recipes. Ah, that's a bummer. Oh, is there something there? Eat that. Put that there. Okay. Give me some firewood. All right. Firewood, please. And... Cook that up. All right. Real quick. Make sure we're good on water. There we go. Drink that. Oh, do we not drink it? Come on. There it goes. And then... Let's add these to make some biofuel. Let's just kind of just shorten things up a little bit. There you go. And there you go. All right. So cool. A lot of progress made. I think tonight's the night we're going to get attacked. How much time do we have? Uh, we got just a few more minutes left in this video. We got a lot of things done, man. But we really need to get the storage going. So let's finish putting out at least the outline of how we're going to do this down here. Man. This is kind of where I'm 100% not sure some spikes would be a good idea. So let's at least get the spikes first just to have a little bit of defense on the outside. Placeable, other, no. Construction, other. Just a little bit of spike action just to keep the front side safe. I know the big guys will run through this, but at least the little ones should not be able to get through, I hope. We just need sticks and a couple logs. We can do that. Okay, we're going to tear you up. Tear up the firewood. Tear up the firewood. All right, grab as many sticks as we can possibly carry. Which is quite a few. All right, grab some logs. All right, we'll throw these to into there. Go grab some ropes, and then we'll be good to go. All right. Okay, just need a couple ropes. There you go. At least a little bit of defense on the front side just so we're not getting wrecked super quick. All right. Uh, rope. One, two. Drop the sticks here. All right. Like I said, it's not much defense, but at least helps a little. Boom. Okay. Just a little bit of defense to keep us a little bit of safe right there. All right. Let's at least start putting the outline before we end the episode so we'll know what we're building next. And I'll start working on this tonight. Wall action. All right. Corners. One, two. Oh, should we do windows up here on this side? Hold on. Window. That guy looks so weird coming over the corner there. All right. Window. And then this will be regular wall. Regular wall. We'll do a window on the back side. And then... Uh... For right now, we'll do, let's do this. For right now, we're going to do a door here. All right. And I don't think I can put a door inside that, can I, until I put it? No. Okay. We need, <laughs> we need logs. So let's get just a little bit more gathering done before the end episode ends. See, how, see what we can get done. Fingers crossed we can get a little bit done. But yeah, I think that'll be okay for our little starter hut over there. And like I said, that's all going to be just the base, and we're going to move up from there, like vertical. Should be cool. One, two, three. There you go. Alright. One, two, three. Alright, one more time this way. Let me at least finish this front. So I have trouble getting through there now. That's interesting. Thought it would be not too tight. But I definitely think tonight's going to be the night we get attacked. So I actually won't start that until the next video. Come on. Let me grab the logs. Okay, we got those ones. Oh, the side ones actually take more. I didn't know that. Look at that. It actually takes five logs. Okay, that's actually something we should know. Okay, there's all of those. All right. I can't grab very many. Hold on. Can I put that in there just for a second? I wish it would flip. Why? <laughs> Hold on. I need you to flip. Like, don't go there. Split one. There you go. 
Oh god. Okay, the answer is no. It Oh god, he can jump. <sighs> Die. Okay, so leaving that other guy dead here did not stop him. Wow. Okay, now we know. Test complete. All right, we have the front done. Yes. Also, they can jump up there. That was an oversight. All right. Now we know. Oh, man. Oh, there's the quiver. Ha-ha. <laughs> Nailed it. We have bow action. Yeah, I'm ready. All right. Wow, that was a little scary. Okay, hold on. Door action. Door. Boom. Okay. For that one, I just need eight planks, which we have none. So that's pretty close to having some. All right. Time to go work on some planks. Yeah, we got to get some more defense going. We're going to have some trouble tonight, guys. If they attack me, it's not too bad, but... Oh, actually, he despawned. The old one despawned. So they will despawn after a while. Interesting. So we got to start gathering them. Okay, cool. That's news I can use. All right, guys, we're going to end it there. I'm going to do a little bit of gathering, but I will end it before midnight. So if we get attacked, I'll show that in the next episode. Hope you enjoyed it. Like, comment, subscribe. Huge shout out to the patrons for making my servers possible. Huge shout out to you for checking this video out. I really appreciate it. See you in the next one. Thanks.